It's your man Jet Rod here. And I want to talk about one of my favorite comedians, Bernie Mac. R.I.P. to one of the kings. Now, we all know Bernie Mac had one of the funniest TV shows on earth. Bernie Mac show is one of the classic black sitcoms of all time. But one thing about Bernie that was magical was he didn't star in a lot of movies. And he had minor roles in a lot of movies. But those minor roles in those movies would take over the whole movie. Just like in the movie Life with Eddie Murphy and Martin. The Jiggalang Jiggalang character. You feel me? Pitching woo <laughs> Yo, Bernie was so funny in this. I mean, his scenes was magical. Bernie could take over a movie with just a few seconds. Also, like his character, the pastor from Friday. <laughs> Miss Parker, Miss Parker. <laughs> You feel me? Bernie was magical, man. You got to think about it. In the movie Friday, iconic. Probably the greatest hood movie of all time. And Bernie was only in it for probably about three or four minutes. Maybe not even four minutes. Maybe three, two, three minutes. And Bernie stole the show. You feel me? I mean, Friday got a lot of magical scenes. But you can't tell me, Bernie, Miss Parker, you feel me? The midget running outside to get Bernie. You feel me? That ain't one of the funniest scenes in movie history. Another scene that Bernie stole the show from. Players Club. Dollar Bill. You feel me? Now, his iconic role about women twerking in Africa. You got to hear that, man. It's a thing of beauty how Bernie just break it down. How the black women are so fine. You feel me? Hey. But the whole movie was centered around Dollar Bill Script Club. So Bernie was, even though he was in the movie for only a couple minutes, he had the most important part. It's crazy how Bernie could steal a show with just a little bit. And Bernie is always hilarious. Now, the one movie that Bernie did star in, in this match, it's one of my favorite movies of all time. Okay, what nobody say. Mr. 3000. Because I'm Ross. <laughs> Yo, Bernie was amazing in this movie. You know what I'm saying? We had Angela Bassett in this one. This is, this is To me, this is one of those underrated classics. You feel me? But Bernie was Bernie was magical, and you could tell he was a Chicago kid. You feel me? He was like Chicago got some of the greatest comedians of all time. And Bernie, you feel me? Bernie really he he showed us that black culture in baseball. You feel me? Something we don't see a lot. You feel me? It used to happen in Chicago a lot, but they kind of took baseball out of Chicago. That's a whole different story. But you know, Bernie really broke it down, and his character, Mr. 3000, Stan Ross, you feel me, the big-time b-ball player, man, Bernie is a genius.